Hi Glamates! It's me again, Gla, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's episode, it's another bag review. I'll be talking about a coach bag. And the name of this bag, it's Coach um, Soft Tubby Shoulder Bag. And I'll be talking about what fits, try on, and also um, measurements. And yeah, uh, my thoughts about this bag. But before I do that, I just want to say thank you for those of you who just recently subscribed and watched my latest episodes. Thank you guys so much. If you're new here, my name is Gla. And if you find my content interesting, I just hope you consider subscribing and hit that bell button so that you always get a notification every time I have a new video. <laughs> Without further ado, um, this is the bag that I'll be talking about. I want you to see the bag first, close up, front of the bag, side, back, side, front again, bottom, and then top of the bag. Okay, the material of this bag, very interesting. It's actually straw in a combination of soft and smooth leather. Um, the color is red-orange. It has the C, chunky C in front. It's in brass hardware. It's not button closure there. Um, it's also in brass hardware. Um, no slip pocket at the back. And then to be very honest, na siya ako kasi um, straw pala. Well, hindi na naman ako nag-check. But yun nga, straw yung material niya. I'm not so sure if this one is like magtatagal siya or okay ba yung quality niya. Because this is the first time that I have a straw um, na bag. Uh, there. So, isa to sa mga sale na binili ko and plan ko to resell. Even though I'm going to resell this, I'm still gonna provide you my honest review about it. Okay? Inside of the bag, it's a fabric um, lining. Para siyang yung 1941 collection na canvas, yung material niya. It, this one, it's a leather. Maganda. Ang ganda nung ano niya, nung mga um, stitches and all even. Ang ganda talaga nung parang C na lock ng tabi collection. Kasi super chunky. Su chunky na super pa. I mean, chunky C. So, if, if your name starts with letter C, then that's good for you. Then, inside of the bag, okay, by the way, it has this D-rings, um, ano rin siya, brass hardware, and then it comes with this short strap and um, long adjustable strap and also dust bag inside. And then, um, here, yan, ito yung main compartment and meron siyang zipper compartment and nakikita niyo yung feed ng bag. Um, then, the style code is CA032 if you would like to search and it comes with this care card and ito yung tag. Again, the style code is CA032. Um, the color is red, orange, black, and the price, the suggested retail price is $395. So, mahal din pala talaga siya. But I got this one. Oh my God, I forgot. Pero lalagay ko na lang dyan pag naalala ko. So, there. Um, those are the um, features of this bag. Now, in terms of measurements, for the length of this bag, this one is 10.5 inches. And then for the height, it's 6.5 inches. For the width, this one is 3.25 inches. The drop of this short strap is 9 inches. And the drop of this long adjustable strap is 21.5 inches. So later, I'll demo how it looks. Kapag suot natin siya sa crossbody and a long shoulder bag. Now let me put some items inside for you to have an idea what can you put inside of the bag. So I have with me my purse. It holds... um cards, coins. Huwag niyo kong gayahin, guys. Sabi ko nga, dapat hindi pinagahalo yung cards and coins kasi nga, baka ma-scratch yung chip. So, dapat hiwalay siya. <laughs> but in the meantime, nilagay ko kasi lahat ng coins ko dito. So, there. Um, my key holder. There. Um, my comb. And then, perfume. Alcohol. And, alam niyo yan guys, lagi ako nagdadala ng baby powder. My pressed powder or the power foundation from Happy Skin. And then, this one, my favorite na, <laughs> the tint from Happy Skin also from their newest or latest edition ng um, lip mallow. And let me see if I can close the bag. So there, those are the items that I put inside of the bag. That is just 
you know, an example, guys. Pagagamitin ko to, yun yung mga dadalhin ko. And the bag, it's still light. Okay? So, again, those are the things that you can put inside of the bag. Now, I'm going to show you how it looks um, kapag gamit ko na itong bag as a shoulder bag. And apologies kasi nasa bahay lang ako. So, yeah, ito lang yung outfit ko for today. But this is how it looks as a shoulder bag. Then, yan. Um, front of the bag. Tingin yung drop niya. Hindi siya masakit sa kilikili. So, you can move freely. Yan. So, this is how it looks. Side. There. Nice as a shoulder bag. And then, you have an option um, for casual look. You can use this strap, adjustable strap. Um, leather strap, actually. Um, it has five holes for adjustments. So, I already attached the long adjustable strap and removed the short strap. So, what I like about it is that natatanggal itong short strap. So, hindi mo kailangan na nandyan lang siya tapos lalagay mo yung um, long strap. So, yeah. Yung iba kasi, hindi natatanggal. So, ang tendency, nandyan lang and pangit siya tignan. But this one, natatanggal yung short strap niya which is um, better. Now, um, for your reference, I'm 5'2 in height and yung hole niya nasa middle. Okay? And this is how it looks as a crossbody bag. There. Front. Side. Ang ganda as a crossbody bag. Yan. Hindi lang masyadong halata kasi parang pare sila ng color ng shorts ko. But this one is burnt orange with a combination of leather trimming na black. As well as yung strap niya, black smooth leather. So, there. You can actually adjust this based on your preference. And, sige. Ilagay natin siya sa shortest setting. Let's see if okay siya as a long shoulder bag. This is how it looks as a long shoulder bag. Okay lang din naman. Yan. And also, if you're taller, perfect sa inyo as a long shoulder bag. But sa akin, hindi. I would rather use this as a crossbody instead of a long shoulder bag. But, if you want to, why not, diba? So there, those are the ways on how you can use this bag. My thoughts about this bag, um, well, to be very honest, I don't have anything against about this bag except for the material, the straw, because I'm not so sure kung quality siya, kung tatagal siya, and all that. Kasi, I feel like baka pag natanggal to, or nagunting, or sumabit, wala. Tapos na, yung mahal-mahal pa ng bag. But, I like yung combination ng red, orange, and black. Maganda siya. Uh, I feel like pwede siyang um, dressed up and dressed down also. I also like this chunky C in front. Para siyang pisas talaga sa bag. Yung bag, napaka-simple. Pero dahil sa C, gumanda. Um, there. Uh, maraming kulay yung pagpipilian. But, ito kasi yung nag-sale in... Maganda rin naman siya, guys, to be very honest. Especially in person. Yun lang talaga ang material niya, guys. Yun lang yung concern ko. And this is just a small bag. Inside, what I like about this one is, hindi siya komplikado. Main compartment lang. You can just put your um, KK kit, your wallet, your phone inside, and you're good. Also, um, what I like about this bag, meron siyang two straps na pagpipilian um, if you want a shoulder bag, use this um, short strap. If you want crossbody or um, long shoulder bag, use this long adjustable strap. And then, natatanggal sila, guys, pareha. So, maganda. Hindi nakakaabala yung short strap sa long strap. So, there. Um, this one is quite expensive. I feel like maalala ko. Um, probably because of the suggested price then and because of the material, probably mahal yung straw. I don't know, to be very honest. Um, kung papipili na ko dun sa tabi na full leather, I'll go with the full leather because I'm not so sure about this straw nga. Yun yung pinaka-concern ko, guys. But the bag itself, it's very nice. Kung leather to, full leather, then yes. Um, I feel like mas magugustuhan ko to because of the compartment inside. Kasi well, hindi siya complicated. Yun nga yung sabi ko. Talagang diretso lang siya. Unlike the tabi 26 kasi na meron pa siyang middle compartment and nagsashare naman sila ng space inside. But since to siya, yun na lang yung pipiliin ko. Pero kung full leather to, ito yung pipiliin ko. So there, um, that's my thoughts about this bag. Thank you again for joining me for today's video. Thank you so much, guys. If you like it, 
give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and if you have any questions comment feedback share in the months in the comment section below i'm interested to know and i'll talk to you again girlmates on my next video bye